positive start to this week. So it's my um, late shift week, as I mentioned at the end of uh, last week's video. And um, uh, so uh, I've had, I've been starting it. I started at twelve today, um, and I went down the gym. Had a quite a good session, but um, I did wake up later than uh, I wanted to, so I didn't get down there to about gone nine o'clock. So. I did um, uh, 15 minutes on the cross trainer, 15 minutes on the bike, did a 10 minute warm up on the uh, treadmill so it was still quite a good session and there was quite a bit of calories burnt I think but um, I left at about 11, came and got ready for work and then went in. Shift went quite smoothly so I'm um, sort of chuffed at that and then... Um, uh, then it's finished. I had some chicken for dinner with uh, jacket potato and some broccoli. So um, that's a fairly healthy-ish dinner. Um, I had a, finished off uh, some of the Cadbury's caramel ice cream I had. So um, uh, I've got no desserts left now for the uh, week. But um, I may, may pop in and get something. But... Um, yeah, no, majority of my bills have come out this month. Um, I've just got my phone, well, both my phone bills to come out, so it's the uh, landline and the mobile, but um, uh, so I've just got to watch my uh, funds up until the end of the month. Um, well, uh, up until uh, to the, the end, well, we're, we're at the end of... Um, uh, January now, but um, I've got to uh, sort of watch it to the 20th of February, and that's when my next payday is. But um, I think I found a way of juggling it, so um, fingers crossed that all works out. But um, yeah, anyway, I'm gonna be heading off to bed now. I'm gonna try and get up a bit earlier and um, head down the gym tomorrow. So oh, I will see you guys tomorrow. It's Tuesday, so positive news. I made it to the um, uh, gym this morning, so I did really good workout session. Um, managed to go down there about 8 in the morning in the end, so um, uh, managed to get in quite a good session. And then at the afterwards, I went up to Tesco to get some corn flour. Um, I use that for a cooking dish I'm doing later this week, but... Um, yeah, um, tonight I've uh, decided to cook noodles, so um, that's just the aftermath, I've made up a sauce there, but I've put some of it onto my plate, so I've got it with broccoli and chicken, and my usual ramen as well, um, I like to drain it, and then um, put a little bit of the, the juice in there, but um, yeah, so the kitchen's a bit messy at the moment after that. Um, my shift went quite well at work, so I was quite happy with that. We had a bit of training today, so um, always a good thing. But uh, yeah, so um, I'm going to have my dinner in a second, and uh, as you know, I like my um, uh, Japanese ramen oriental food. Kind of fits, because I'm half Cantonese, but... Um, yeah, um, but uh, it'll probably be, oh, GoPro cut off again, but I'm going to probably call it a night for tonight and um, head off to, uh, after I've done this, have a shower, probably chill out and then head to bed. But um, anyways, I will see you guys tomorrow. Well, I'm happy with how Wednesday's gone, so um, I made it the third day in a row to the gym, so chuffed at that, really chuffed. Um, I did uh, 15 minutes um, on the cross trainer, uh, 15 minutes uh, on the bike, and 15 minutes on the rower. I um, also did a 10 minute sort of warm up walk on the um, treadmill and then finished up with a 10 minute uh, run, um, so sort of gradually in increasing the level but sort of walking, sort of like doing a minute walking, a minute running. Um, so that's, um, I'm quite, quite chuffed at that. Um, also walked to the gym as well, so really happy. Um, had a salad for brunch, so again, so I used up the rest of the steak and used up my um, uh, Italian leaves as well. Uh, then tonight I had a pork chop, it was on my mum done me, I did a jacket potato, had it with broccoli, so um, 
uh, kept healthy. I also, also had um, some apples with my lunch at work, so also uh, happy at that as well. Um, I sort of thrown away my recycling stuff for the week, so I'm happy with, I've, I've got that done. Um, and then I also did prep for my dinner tomorrow night, so I'm going to do um, noodles. It's going to be the beef noodles, we're going to do a slightly diff different recipe. So I've already prepared the beef, so I've got some, uh, it's in my fridge here. That's all been marinated. Uh, probably doesn't look uh, that appealing at the moment as it's raw, but um, what I've done, I've marinated it with sugar, uh, uh, sea salt, uh, soy sauce, uh, corn flour, and um, and some uh, cooking oil as well. So that's all sort of bound it together, and then um, I'm going to cook it, fry it up tomorrow with a little bit of oil, and um, yeah, see how that that goes. Um, it's sort of usually how my mum usually cooks it at home. So I've sort of got the recipe from her. And um, I'm going to do that with um, the beef ramen now. It does come with a little bit of um, sauces all around and does. It's sort of, uh, this brand, which um, I was able to get in Sainsbury's this weekend, but they also sell it at the Tesco's near my work. And um, also, um, and also the... Uh, um, uh, as does as well. So um, uh, also the Oriental food shop I go to in Southampton also stocks it as well. So, but um, yeah, uh, well my shift at work went well as well. So, um, it, uh, I'm going to say thanks to Jordan. Um, he's looked after our team after Sarah went, but also he's sort of covered the days when um, my current team managers are on a. On a Lee day, so um, so thanks, Jordan, and thank you for your support. Um, it's uh, been uh, you, you uh, as as I put in the um, uh, feedback for you. Um, I think you're an asset to the company I work for. So, um, but uh, yeah. Anyway, I am going to be um, heading off. That's quite late. I'm aiming to make it day four at the gym. Um, Hopefully, go make make it to Friday as well and get five days in there. But um, yeah. But uh, anyway, I will see you guys. Well, it's uh, Thursday today, so I'm home from work and I'm gonna do some of my noodles. So um, doing a bit of the cooking here. So as I've got my ramen kit there, and here's the um, uh, beef I prepared last night. Now uh, I've got the water just boiling up there for the ramen. And the um, uh, I've got some oil ready to go so I can cook the beef in. Now you may hear a bit of noise. I've also got my washing going on as well at the moment. But um, yeah, uh, I'm looking forward to tasting this. I'm sort of trying one of my mum's recipes, and um, uh, so I've pre-prepared that last night so I can just get in there while I'm on late this week. Um, so I'll let you know how it tastes, and then I'll probably do a bit of a roundup of how today went. It's um, sort of been an, an oddish day, but I'll go into that a bit later. But anyway, catch you later. I've now got the uh, ramen uh, noodles in there, so they're getting ready. And then I've also put the beef in as well, so that's just frying up. Uh, just to give it a bit of a stir. And uh, hopefully that will come out all nice. But um, I'm gonna... I'll uh, sort of come back to you a bit later once this is complete and um, uh, we'll uh, run over how it went but um, I'm looking forward to this Uh, here it goes. Um, this is kind of the finished product. Now, there's quite a bit of meat there. Um, I think what I'm going to do also is give it kind of like the authentic uh, Chinese experience. My old favourite, the soy sauce. Uh, now, put a bit of it on here as well. But, um, yeah, um, it's, uh, it's quite a bit of meat on there. Um, 
It would be enough for two portions, but I'm quite hungry at the moment and I do like my meat. So I've got some broccoli in there as well. Now, um, here goes on the taste test. Mmm. Mm, yeah, no, that that's that's nice. Um, I'm going to try this again. This is sort of like um, a deviation from my usual balsamic vinegar. I think I might try it with balsamic vinegar and preparing it this way in future. So I've got the corn flour there um, and then marinating it overnight. I think it needs a bit more something, but um, my mum can get it quite. Um, it's not as good as my mum's, but uh, it will do. So I'm, I'm going to tuck into this now. Then I'll catch up in a bit, let you know how it all went. Anyway, see you in a bit. Well, it's uh, quite late on Thursday now, so um, yeah, the uh, noodles were really nice. And I was quite happy for trying that recipe, so it's definitely on the cards again. Um, overall, the day's been quite a weird one. Um, so I woke up absolutely aching, so that was from the gym. Um, so that wasn't a great start, and then... Um, when I uh, then opened my blinds, it was just not nice weather. So that was and then another good, not a good start. But um, I trudged down to the gym and then um, uh, started started doing my warm up, and it kind of didn't feel right. Um, and then I did 15 minutes on the cross trainer, and that was a struggle. So I just did 10 minutes each on everything else and then um, uh, then came back. I had a sweet potato uh, for um, brunch and then went off to work. It went smoothly from then on and then obviously I came back and did my things. Now uh, I kind of fell asleep on the sofa after dinner but um, uh, and now I'm starting to feel... It's a bit more, but I'm, I'm going to go back to a normal bed now and then um, see how I feel in the morning. But uh, anyway, so I will see you guys tomorrow. Well, it's uh, Friday, so it's actually still in the morning. Um, I've been quite, I've been a lot more motivated today, as you can um, probably guess. But um, yeah, no, I, I got up, um, felt okay, actually, um, although the weather was similar to yesterday, um, I somewhat got over it. So I went down the gym, and then I was, um, I felt motivated, and um, I was back up to uh, my usual uh, workout regime. So uh, I managed to get 15 minutes on the cross trainer, rower, and bike. Um, I got, uh, I did a 10 minute run to finish off with before my stretches. And also did um, a 10 minute warm up on the, on the treadmill as well, of, um, power walking. So I'm um, quite positive. I'm going into work shortly. I'm just doing my um, tea. Uh, probably can hear my kettle going uh, back over. But um, yeah, uh, all positive and uh, sort of ready to take on the day. But uh, I'll catch up in a bit, guys. So now Friday night. Uh, so. Um, uh, I did make it, as I said, to the gym. Um, now starting to feel it. Um, I think tomorrow I'm going to be aching all over. Um, so I'm so, uh, not going to be doing stuff for it's the weekend now. Um, but hopefully going to get back in the gym on Monday. Now, um, shift went quite well. We had um, a sort of meeting and a uh, sort of brief of our... Um, Manager, so that was that was quite good, and there's a couple of teams in there, so all fun. And then, um, I mean, later on in the day, we got some. Uh, we ordered in a pizza, so um, we had a couple of slices each, and then uh, a few hours later, it was the end of my shift, and. Yeah, I came home and then I had some chicken nuggets and chips. Um, I kind of made it my naughty day on food. But, uh, yeah. Anyways, I'm, I'm going to shoot off now. That's, um, this week seems I'm filming quite late again. So, um, 
Uh, I will see you guys tomorrow. Well, I'm back in the fair room, so... Um, uh, it was a bit of a longish journey back. Um, uh, part of the motorway was shut, but um, I was going to stop off um, at the BMW garage. Um, salesman had the car to show me around, so... I'm just still deciding at the moment, but um, it was good to see it, and there's a thanks to Partridge and uh, Chandler's Ford for the, letting me have a look around that. But um, uh, I've sort of got home, I had a quite chilled out night. Um, I'm still aching from doing five days at the gym, so um, it's. Uh, so it. Uh, I got home, I had a bath with some bath salts, and that has helped. Um, but I'm going to be t turning it while I'm already in bed at the moment. But um, I'll be going to sleep shortly. And um, uh, yeah, I, 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 so I cleaned my flat as well today. So I was quite chuffed at that. Um, and then got a bit of washing done. Um, I think tomorrow, I'm gonna, when I get back, I'm going to do some ironing. But. Um, Anyways, I am going to see you guys tomorrow. Well, this is a bit of a late one. Um, I forgot to vlog last night, so this is actually Monday now. But I'm going to try and get this all uploaded shortly, and I'll do a separate one for Monday. But, um, yeah, I've... Um, uh, so, Sunday, um, I uh, got a nice lie-in. I was really, really chuffed at that. Um, I'm still aching from the... Um, the gym, but the, the bath I had the night before really helped. Um, I then went shopping with mum during the day, so I went and got my food supplies. We also went to the range as well. Um, got a reusable water bottle, which I'm going to use down the gym. Um, then um, I got a number of bits and bobs, so that's my food catered for this week. Um, we then went to the pub quiz in the evening, and then at the end of the... We won the pub quiz, so I was really happy, and then I came back here last night. I was quite tired, so I just crashed out, and then forgot to vlog, but um, this is going to be edited shortly. I'm going to be heading to the gym again, so it might go up later than normal. Uh, I do apologise, and then um, hopefully um, get this all up together. But um, I've got the day off um, on Tuesday, and I'll be working tomorrow, which is Monday. Obviously, today's the day it's going up, so I'm all a bit uh, messed up. But uh, anyway, uh, I will see you guys. As always, please like and subscribe. Hopefully, it's not going to be rushed and forgotten about like last this week's has. But... Um, Anyway, I will see you guys tomorrow.